The School of Life Sciences was founded in 2010 by combining the departments of biology and biochemistry, which are among the first departments in CUHK, the Chinese University of Hong Kong. To meet the needs of our society, we offer six four-year bachelor programs, biochemistry, biology, cell and molecular biology, environmental science, food and nutritional sciences, and molecular biotechnology. We plan to offer a new program of marine science. Our professors strive for excellence in research, specializing in various research areas of plant and cell biology, environmental and marine sciences, food and nutritional sciences, genomics and bioinformatics, neuroscience, and protein structural biology. We have two areas of excellence and five collaborative research fund projects supported by the Hong Kong SAR government. Together with other government funding, donations and government contracts, the school has received over 280 million Hong Kong dollars of research funding in the last five years. A state key lab of agrobiotechnology is also hosted in our school among the eight research centres we have. Recognised as an area of excellence by the Research Grants Council, the Centre for Genomic Studies on Plant-Environment Interaction for Sustainable Agriculture and Food Security, envisions to pursue international excellence on innovative agriculture. The centre pledges to establish a stable soybean genetic population with precise annotated genomic information. The Centre for Organelle Biogenesis and Function was also recognised as an area of excellence by the University Grants Council, aimed at understanding the biogenesis and functions of three organelles to address the fundamental questions concerning organelle biogenesis and functions in important biological processes. The Centre for Cell and Developmental Biology provides state-of-the-art facilities to support research in cell and developmental biology. The Simon F. S. Lee Marine Science Laboratory holds several marine biology projects. The dynamics of mangrove and other estuarine tidal marsh and mudflats were studied, providing the scientific basis for wetland management. Genomic approach is used to study microbial evolution and adaptation in marine environments, providing important information for climate change, paleo-oceanic processes and marine conservation. The study of Hong Kong coral ecosystem also investigates the potential roles of Hong Kong corals under global climate changes and other threats to biodiversity. The team is now capable of raising and outplanted baby corals to restore coral community in local waters. Using novel molecular technique to study the diversity, ecology and behaviour in natural populations, particularly marine crustaceans, genetic and phenotypic adaptations of marine organisms to survive through climatic changes was investigated. The information could foster conservation management in natural populations worldwide. To understand animal evolution in terms of their basic biology, from hormones, non-coding RNA regulation, genomes and their relations to the environment, the arthropods, such as the insects, crustaceans, etc., cnidarians, for example, sea anemone, jellyfish, are being explored. Recent research also includes human diseases such as spinocerebellar ataxias, Huntington's disease and myotonic dystrophy, which are rare neurodegenerative and neuromuscular diseases. The molecular basis of cardiovascular dysfunction, with an emphasis on stem cell-based regenerative therapy for cardiovascular diseases, was also studied to cover diabetes, obesity risks for cardiovascular dysfunction. With protein engineering, X-ray crystallography and NMR spectroscopy, our scientists in the Centre for Protein Science and Crystallography study the structure-function relationship of key proteins in cellular signalling and pathogenic microorganisms. These information all have pharmaceutical significance. 
The school has a very special plant specimen collection in its Xu Yinghu herbarium, founded in 1968, with close to 38,000 specimens and a sophisticated specimen collection system to include flora images, DNA and geographical positioning information. Last but not least, our Food Research Centre responds timely to the concerns of food safety and nutritional issues in Hong Kong, China and the region. We encourage our students to learn outside the classroom by involving in academic research, internship, field study, etc. Developing team spirit and communication skills is equally important. Studying life science is challenging and rewarding in developing your careers with a scientific mind using state-of-the-art equipment. Joining us would fulfill your dream and empower you to contribute to our society, innovate the world and change your future.